Hey Veda, it's day two. It's Candace again. We are supposed to talk about how we were introduced to Veda. Um, I saw it on Twitter, a couple different first year we blog, we vlog, Twitter, Veda, people, you know what I mean? We're talking about it. And I believe at that point it was already over and they were just talking about how great it was and how much they loved it and how, but basically, they weren't even necessarily talking about Veda itself. It was more the way that they, the connection they had and the community that I was seeing amongst these people. And I wanted to be part of that. And I missed out on it. So I ended up joining 20 something bloggers and that was fantastic. So really it was these first year people who introduced me to the idea of it. But then it was 20 something bloggers and seeing it when it came around again, mentioned on there, that got me part of it the first year that I did it. Um, I've been doing it for four years now. And basically when I got involved, I got involved because I was lonely. I didn't have friends. Um, I just moved, I had nobody. And um, I met my best friends, thanks to 20 something bloggers. Um, tabs i was in her wedding i'm going with her and my kids to disney world in september um if i ever get married again she will be in my wedding like whole nine yards she is family to me um thanks to 20 something bloggers but veda became kind of an extension of that too because i met so many other people and i got to know them even better because a lot of the people for my first year of Veda, I met them originally through 20 something bloggers and then I just got to know them so much better. So each year I get to know more people and I just love it even more. He gets really happy when I pull out his backpack because he carries his own water and he knows if, he's, if his backpack's coming out, it's time for a hike. So, I promise that I'm not that girl who wears makeup to go on a hike. I wasn't planning on going on a hike today. But then I was like, dude, I need to go on a hike. I haven't been in forever. Usually I go further than this, but you know, it's kind of late. And also, I haven't been in forever. So it was like, oh, I'm dying. <laughs> so I didn't die, but I don't want it to be dark. By the time I get to my car, I'm gonna break a leg. So I love you, all your faces. I love them. But I love his too. A lot more. And he'll be very upset with me if I break my leg. This is his anxious. He's anxious right now. He's telling me let's go home. Okay. Okay, we'll go home. Alright. I love all your faces. And I'll talk to you tomorrow.